Good morning guys and welcome back to Wonder Walkers. Today we are going for a little road trip just up to Gosford, uh, just north of Sydney. And we thought we'd take a day just to go to the beaches there and really have a nice look around, have some lunch. And of course we're taking Suki with us, you can see her in the back there. We've just taken her to the dog park to kind of get her energy out. Um, so she's a little bit more calmer in the car, which hopefully it's going to work and she's not gonna to feel too car sick. Um, but yeah, we're hoping to have a really nice day. I think Dan just got the drone working this morning or last night. So I'm hoping we're gonna get some really good shots today of some of the beaches and the coastline there. And we hope you guys enjoy the vlog. We are making our first stop today at McDonald's though because breakfast at McDonald's is doing the day right, right? <laughs> Gosford not long ago and we are just walking along uh, some of the streets here. We wanted to get Suki out of the car just so she could take a breather because she was feeling a little bit sick I think and she's just having the time of her life now going for a big walk. So we're going to stay here for a little bit longer and then probably go get a juice or something really nice like a nice drink somewhere um, even if that means we go on to Terrigal or Avoca Beach because uh, it would be just such a nice day for it and it is I think there is a dog friendly beach near Terrigal um, don't quote me on that but yeah we're looking forward to that now it is such a hot day it's like 28 degrees already um, but it's going to be so nice. So after that walk around Gosford we're so exhausted and got some juice. We're just sitting in the park and we're gonna have some juice and we'll probably head off to Terrigal very soon. Which one do you want? Hmm, you want I think uh, I want the raspberry one. Raspberry? Yeah. Thank you. Go. Suki wants to try some. Want some juice? <laughs> yes. Just giving Suki some cut up carrot. She actually quite likes carrot. She likes banana. She likes lots of different fruits and vegetables and we like to give it to her as snacks, like in the car and that. Sometimes it can be better than some of the really salty dog treats. Um, but we do have some of those as well for her, but sometimes it's nice just to give her some fresh food along the way too. Good for her tea. So now we're going on to Terrigal or Avoca. We haven't actually decided yet, um, but we're going to take a drive out there. And I, like I said before, I think there's a dog friendly beach. So it would be nice to kind of get Suki off lead a little bit more. We don't always get a chance to do that with her. And it's really important for her training that we kind of keep doing that and um, making sure that she's getting used to being off lead as well as on lead and that her recall is kind of getting better as well. So Suk is sitting in the back seat. She's nice and hot and she's had a big walk. She's drooling a little bit because she does have that little bit of anxiousness getting in the car again. But I do find that during the day, she tends to get better as we go along and she tends to get a little bit less sick uh, the more we're in and out of the car. I think it's just the thought of it getting in there initially for her is not always the best, but we're working at it. We're giving her chicken <laughs> at certain times. And that seems to be helping a little bit. She seems to be a little bit more interested in getting in the car, which is great. But now we're going to go and head to the beach. And thank God we are because it is so hot at the moment. <laughs>
So we've just walked along the promenade here at Terrigal along the beach. It was so beautiful. Such good views there. The waves looked amazing. Really, really wanted to go for a swim actually, but we didn't bring any swimmers unfortunately. It would have been the perfect day. I think it's about 28 degrees Celsius, so perfect day to swim. Uh, but we just took Suki for a walk along the promenade, just took some great photos and some videos. Now we're going to head up a bit further north to a place called Shelley North Beach and we believe that there's an off-leash dog park there so we're going to try and take Suki off the leash and let her run around for a little bit so hopefully that's good and hopefully she's got enough energy to actually do that. We are currently at North Shelley Beach so we decided to come here to the dog beach here because it was a little bit busier and I think we missed the turn off for that ages ago. Um, but yeah, it looks so beautiful here so we're going to take Suki maybe off lead if she's lucky. <laughs> And we might do a little bit of training with her and yeah, just enjoy the beautiful weather and the beach. up and Suki is very very confused and concerned. She's literally eating the sand right now just ignoring us completely and tucking in. And smooth. <laughs> oh, God. Once again, someone is very, very tired in the back here, so hopefully it should be a good car ride home. But she was really good off lead. Um, I was really impressed with her actually. We're always a little bit uh, worried taking Suki off lead because she is so fast and we have been told that with whippets, greyhounds or sighthounds, you really need to train them off the lead so it's easier, you know, and, and they're not gonna get really spooked if one day they get out of the house or if they, um, you know, kind of run away and don't come back. And they can kind of go for small animals like birds and things like that very easily that's in their prey drive and it's always a bit of a worry but I felt like today she did so well I couldn't believe how good she was in staying close to us I had a bag of treats nearby and as you can see on camera I mean she had a ball um, she did this thing that we like to call frog dog where she frogs like she hops like a frog because she's running so fast and it's just like the most hilarious thing she just has the most the, the best time doing it and she's so fast which is kind of scary at the same time but We've had a really good day. I think we might just go and look for some food at the moment or something to take on the way home. And then I think we're going to end the vlog because it's been a really long day and we've gotten a lot of footage, which has been good. That was such a long day. We took Suki to the dog park this morning. So yeah, we came up to central, the central coast. First we started in Gosford, just walked around there, tired Suki out for a little bit. Then we drove up to Terrigal 
had another walk around, just took some really beautiful shots of the region. And then we drove up even further north to north of Shelly Beach and we let Suki off the leash for a little while and we also put the drone up and it was so much fun. She had the best time ever. And uh, we really enjoyed our trip as well. We would love to come back up and spend even more time and even possibly stay the night. We're unable to stay the night because I have to go to work tomorrow. Otherwise we would have, but otherwise it's been a great day. Thank you so much for watching the vlog. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you do and click the notification bell. Make sure you follow us on Instagram as well and we will see you in the next video. Bye.